Here are the handles that I make for these tools uh, to use under the power hammer. Most of the ones like this, the half round, really useful tool, uh, probably about 18 inches long, a uh, quarter inch round. And when you make this, you can just round off the end so there's no sharp corners on there. This is 3 16 by one flat bar. This one, you're gonna wanna grind the, the round in here and then contour all of the edges where you're gonna be holding it with your hand. It will make a huge difference in the way this tool feels when you're using it. So, I like these. That's about the, the right length for that, 16 inches. You can always make them a little bit longer, 17 or 18, because over time, on, especially on a punch, this weld will probably break or this will get banged up and you can, you can just cut it off and clean the punch up and put it back, move it back and re-weld. And then you can just keep doing that over time until it gets too short. A reason why I do like to weld the steel over the top of the punch rather than using tongs is that if the punch gets stuck and you need to have some leverage, you can put, let's say if you're making a hammer, put the hammer in the vise and while you're trying to get this unstuck, it won't slip on you inside the hole. I mean, if it were a pair of tongs grabbing that, uh, the tongs would slip on it. So that's why I like that to be, to be welded over the top. I'll go ahead and make these two handles. After I, I shape these, I always like to, to throw them in the water too, just to give them a little, little extra spring. And if you find that that has a little too much curve, you can always put it across something. And take some of that curve out of it. And then just throw it in the water. And there's your handle. It's got a, a, some nice spring to it. There's that one. There's a the second one. As I said, you're always going to want a little gap in between here. It helps give it some flex there while you're using the tool. And that's how I make those two, hand those two handles.